Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Here is another Diptyque unboxing haul, but this time it is the Diptyque's City Candle. Diptyque has relaunched its popular City Candles for one week only. It started on April 15th up to April 21st, which was yesterday. So this video is another collaboration with my best friend Trish. I'm gonna include a short video clip from Trish, her unboxing haul of the Diptyque City Candles. So if you're new to my channel, welcome. I upload videos every week about luxury, fashion, beauty, diptyques, unboxing. If these are your type of videos, please consider subscribing to my channel. And also don't forget to hit the bell so you will not miss any of my future videos. I will be sharing with you today what city candles that I purchased this time. So without further ado, let's start with my current city candles collection from diptyque if you've been subscribed to my channel if you remember last year i started my diptyque journey last june when diptyque relaunched their u.s city candles which are beverly hills new york and miami so i was able to purchase on the website this was my very first city candle which is beverly hills because i'm from california and beverly hills has this exclusive city candles so only beverly hills has city candles in california beverly hills candle is floral it's a floral family with white flower mint lemon i really really love this candle i love floral scents this is one of the best city candles the beverly hills candle embodies the city's palm trees lush gardens in the shade of which bloom enticing bouquets of white flowers mingled with mint and lemon to create a radiant accord. So this retails for $76. It used to be $74, but they increased their price. And this is in the standard size, which is 190 grams. And it burns approximately um, 60 hours. Then in, I think, September, October of last year, they relaunched again all of the popular city candles last year was able to purchase it on the website both of them i purchased online on the diptyque website london and paris but i'm going to talk about first london london is another favorite of mine because it's also in, in the floral family i love the jar it's in this beautiful floral detailing the vessel celebrates traditional bright and refined english wallpapers and pays homage to those of the historic Westbourne Grove Diptyque Boutique. The notes are heliotrope, lilac, juniper, hyacinth. Discover a city's unique spirit through the perfumed notes of a candle. The scent of the London candle takes you to the Columbia Road Flower Market. Its unique notes of heliotrope, lilac, juniper, and hyacinth are warmed with a touch of spice. And the next one is, of course, my favorite city which is Paris. Although this is my favorite city and I've been to Paris and also London, I've been to London. That's why I have to get all the city candles that I've been to. It has the lavender chypre. It's a family of chypre. Notes are chypre and lavender. Discover a unique with ornate decoration revealing the capital as seen from the sky. The pattern pays homage to the iconic city of light. A gradient blue and gray illuminated with touches of pink symbolizes the light of the setting sun reflecting on the scene. Discover a city's unique spirit through the perfumed notes of Diptyque's city candles. The Paris candle takes you to the heart of Saint Germain, emblematic district of Parisian chic. A mysterious chypre accord accentuated with a hint of lavender. So these are the three candles that I have from last year. These are all made in France. Before I move on to my unboxing, I would like to insert a clip from my dear friend Trish. She's gonna show you guys one of the city candles that she got. Make sure to subscribe to her channel as well and follow her on Instagram. Hi guys, it's Trish. Hello from Madame's channel. So I'm gonna show you guys what candle I got. So I'm gonna show you guys the Paris candle. So here is the box packaging. It looks so pretty. I love the detailing on the box. And it was also wrapped with these beautiful tissue paper. And now let's talk about the candle design and the scent. So here is Paris up close. It's such a beautiful, it's kind of like a turquoise kind of color. 
and it's a little bit like a matte um, like candle it says Paris right there and it smells so good I think this is one of my favorite city candles like the scent it smells amazing so this one has lavender in it and the description online says that the Paris candle takes you to the heart of Saint Germain an emblematic district of Parisian chic a mysterious crypt accord accentuated with a hint of lavender and this one smells so good you guys if I were to recommend like a candle from the city candles I'd recommend Paris but honestly they all really smell so good I love the two candles a lot and yeah so it's just a short little clip telling you guys about the the Tic city candles and I actually got a lot of gifts with my purchase so if you guys Want to see what else I got from Diptyque? Madame will link my video down below. And yeah, so I will see you guys maybe in my video. Bye! So that is my friend Trish. Make sure to check out her channel to see what else she got. I'm going to link her video down below or up here. The reason why they are relaunching the uh, city candles because of this pandemic because most of us, we couldn't travel. I mean, it's still not safe to travel, but we're getting there. That's the reason why they are doing this exclusive relaunching of city candles for a short period of time at the uh, diptych stores or you can purchase it on the website. Before I share with you my unboxing of this, the rest of the city candles, that I purchased for this year I wanted to show you guys the gift with purchase the gifts or samples that I got when I purchased four of the city candles and two from another store so this one I got an amber mini candle and two of the eau de toilette and also I got this special gift which is the diptyque matches special matches thank you for that as you can see this blue box when I receive the city candles they are not individually gift wrapped because you know we understand they're very busy but I asked for a box because I don't have that blue box yet I asked specifically if I could have just the box I didn't know she put a ribbon as well um, so I got four city candles I will open first the Miami city candle so Miami is also in the floral family. It has magnolia and citrus. So the description online sent the Miami candle offers an exotic aroma of delicate magnolia blossoms enhanced by delicious citrus notes reminiscent of key lime pie, Florida's signature dessert. The candle draws its inspiration from the city's graphic design universe with a motif combining banana leaves with small beach umbrellas as seen from the sky. I've been to Florida, I've been to Orlando, Florida, but not yet in Miami. So that is that and we're going to open the three city candles from the blue gift box. Up next is the New York City and then this one in New York uh, we are going to visit my good that I already have this. Um, New York city candle so I don't need to bother going to the stores going to the boutique just to pick up the New York readily available for me New York is in the woody family it has cedar wood vetiver patchouli and incense the New York candle evokes the golden age of alluring species and the, the city's nightlife notes of cedar wood vetiver and patchouli heightened by mysterious incense are a scent echo of these legendary and contemporary sites. The candle's golden art deco motif on a midnight blue background is an elegant reference to the architectural style that has always shaped the city. The next one is Tokyo. Tokyo is one of the cities that I wanted to go to because I was supposed to visit my son over there. However, he's done with his assignment, so he's now back to the US. This is the beautiful box. It's inspired by the imitable art of Japanese gardens. Its decoration invokes the harmony and serenity of Tokyo's Yoyogi Koen and Shinjuku Kyoen parks. This Tokyo city candle is in woody family as well. It has cypress and incense 
scent to it. The aroma of the Tokyo candle revives the fond memory of a stroll along alleyways in the shade of Japanese cypress trees, where a temple diffuses notes of soothing incense. So Tokyo City Candle, this is in the Woody family. It has cypress and incense scent to it. So that is the Tokyo. Now moving on, uh, we have Shanghai. So this is the box of Shanghai City Candle. The glass comes in a symbolic color range. The deep red of Chinese lacquer is decorated with a blue porcelain foliage. It is displayed in a box designed as an ode to the beauty and refinement of, of Haksin Ting, Shanghai's oldest tea house. I don't know if I said it correctly. Shanghai Candle. It is also in this beautiful floral family. It has osmanthus and green tea. The scent of the Shanghai Candle is closely linked to a Chinese tradition. Deliciously perfumed osmanthus flowers complemented with notes of green tea, like a homage to the tea ceremony. I've been to China several times, but not in Shanghai. Uh, it's in another city. So that's that for Shanghai. And the next one, I got these two, these two city candles for, from another boutique because the boutique that I usually go to, they didn't have these two city candles when I pre-ordered them weeks before the relaunching of the city candles. So, so I was able to pre-order this from Beverly Hills store. I will be unboxing one city candle from the Beverly Hills store and the other one will be featured in Trish video. So make sure to check out her channel so you will see what was the last item that I got. Uh, before I open this, this is the gift with purchase that I got from Liptique Beverly Hills Boutique. They still have this gift with purchase limited edition notebook. So because when you purchase 150, you'll be able to avail of this notebook. The sales associate was so nice. He's able to provide me this with no questions, no drama. He also gave me this sample mini candle. Bay candle is really, really good. This is a really good scent of candle. This is one of my favorites. So moving on, uh, we're going to open the second to the last item. This is in this beautiful purple with pink wrapping. Just a note, they normally match whatever the color of the packaging of the Tic product. So what I got is the second to the last item is the Hong Kong candle. This is the box. This is the beautiful box of Hong Kong City candle. It's decorated with a colorful graphic pattern. The candle is inspired by the city's urban density. The climbing orchid dresses the city with vertiginous architecture, flowers, and foliage. So Hong Kong City Candle is also in the floral family which is I love the scent of this candle. It has orchid, it has vanilla. So the Hong Kong City Candle is an odd to nature expressed through notes built around the famous Bohemia Blekenia accented with a floral vanilla accord. So this is the Hong Kong City Candle. I've been to Hong Kong also several times. So check out the last item in Trish video so you will see what is the last item that I got in this beautiful green and yellow combination of the wrapping. Okay, that is all for today's video. If you have any questions, leave it in the comment section below. Make sure to follow us on Instagram. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so you will be alerted when I upload a new video. I have something coming up my unboxing, and my shopping vlogs. I'll see you next time. Thank you guys for watching. Bye!